Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Romance Vampire in Love. We are making quite a bit of progress, especially, I know I keep bringing this up at every episode at this point, but I love that we have a map to show us where we need to go next. And so now we have a hidden object scene. Okay, there's the hook. We found a screwdriver. Okay. Where to map? Okay, to the basement. Okay. So honestly, when they have. Okay. I was saying when they had those little symbols, is that something was there we needed to find? One of the collectibles we needed to find? Ah! Need a zipper! Okay, that is a number, it's like a number 8, and we have the extra gear. Where to next? Okay, we're gonna go to the secret passage. Is this one there? No. Does it need the gears? No. Okay. Ah, this needs gears. Okay. Do here. Make a single working mechanism out of these gears. Pick up the gear and place it on the hole so that it becomes a part of the mechanism. Oh, okay. So I have to connect. Okay, and whoa! Ah, there's the other part. Okay, there's another gem. Okay, that's it. Nothing updated. Okay. And on to should. Here's where we are right now in the shed. The barn. Okay. Uh, the little bat is Enron's location because he's a vampire. Okay. Add that here. She be reaching her hand out? Emily's portrait has come alive. I can give her the stones so that she has them. Oh, that's a neat animation. Soon my father realized that I'm looking for Emily, I have to hurry. Oh. Found a lens. So you just ripped it right like just like that? Hmm. Reaching into this trap with bare hands isn't the best idea. I have to find some way to open it. No, okay. Where to? Garden. Find the right magic mirror. This is a lens, so... Ah... I think I connect to Emily through this hollow. Or get something useful. Okay, it's telling us to switch to Emily, so let's do that. Found the gravestone. Okay, let's go to the grave. Ah, it's a hidden object scene. Let's do that first, and then we'll do the grave. 
Okay. So envelope with the seal. There's an envelope but we need a seal to it. And there's a lit candle there. We can probably make a seal. Okay. Ah! There you go. And we need a shoe. Where is a shoe? There's a shoe. We found scissors! I was hoping for another hammer or something so we can smash more things. Okay, here we go to the graystone. Brigitta. Wait, no. Why am I grabbing the scissors? Gravestone. Whoa. Put down all the stones on the slab by clicking them. Note that the stones affect each other. When some go down, others go up. Oh, I think the poor girl needs something to find peace. Oh, is her little body? What is that? Why are we taking this? Possibly detail. This is the little girl's skeleton and seems she needs something to rest in peace. I don't think she needs a fish. Do you need a fish? No. Okay. Where do we need to go next? To the cabinet. Oh yeah, there was a detail here. Where's that creaking coming from? Great, I managed to open this door and now I can get into this room. And go into this room. It was like a bedroom, but it was abandoned long ago. I wonder who lived here. I have an idea from the toys. There's more garlic. There's one of those wind-up monkeys. There's a little box under the monkey. I think I can open it if I find a second symbol for it. Can't reach was hidden in this inkwell with my bare hands. What is this? Flintstone. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I thought about the Flintstones there for a second. Jetta most likely loved to play with this doll. I feel so sorry for her. If I'm pronouncing, if I'm mispronouncing, um, Brigetta or Brigida, um, incorrectly, I'm sorry. Does not. Can't be undone. I have to find something to cut it with. We have scissors. Okay, that is behind the curtain, and it's a bed. I didn't read what it said up there. Okay, we have. Oh, we have a bear. Cause it's hidden under this upholstery, I have to tear it off somehow. What do you have here? Teeth token. Mm, not with the hook. We have a statue. Okay, other parts of the map have opened up. Let's go to the cave. Oh, we have a piece of flint. There we go. Okay, now the is lit up. We will continue this when we get back to this very shortly. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye! <laughs>